I think the first time Eddie got in contact to, well, he got in contact with my manager. I think it was a, I think a week and a half after the fight with McGregor and me, and uh, you know, and it was really exciting. People seeing Eddie was, you know, watching the fight, and uh, you know, and he thought I won the fight as well, and you know, and I'm really excited to be part of the team now. Uh, I came to uh, Glasgow in 2002. I was born in Pakistan. I was born in Gujarat, uh, Gujarat and uh, and I've been in Glasgow for about 17, 18 years. And uh, you know, and it's been my home since then. And I wouldn't want to be anywhere else in the world. I think I moved as a young boy, so for me, it's, you know, it was okay. And obviously, as years went on, obviously the weather is always cold. <laughs> there is always raining. But I, grew, I came as a young boy, so I can't remember too much back home. But you know, it's been on my home, and it's been great. I've loved every minute. The people are great. The city is probably one of the best cities to live in. So yeah, I think my friend took me down in 2010 to the boxing gym and uh, it wasn't a thing I was really interested in, you know, and uh, took me down, I punched a few bags and the guy who was running the gym was an old ex-professional uh, fighter himself and I punched a few bags and I had a bit of circuit skipping and I was going to walk out because it was quite difficult and he came up to me, he's like, I'll bring your gums next, uh, next time you're in and that was it, I sparred the next time I came in and that was it, you know, and you know, the rest is history. I wouldn't, I never dreamed of where I've, what I've achieved and, you know, things I've got in boxing and it's been a blessing. Obviously, it comes with hard work, sacrifice and that as well. But, you know, I, I could never imagine myself the stage I'm at in my career. And, you know, going into the fight, you know, McGregor was always the bigger name. Everybody knew who he was down south. And, you know, a lot of people knew him overall. I was just a fight that's coming up. You know, well, no, coming up, people never knew who I was. And, uh, you know, I surprised a lot of people with my style. And I think I gave a lot of people, you know, told them I'm a threat to that weight. And uh, going to the fight, I was really, really confident. I knew I was going to win the fight. And, you know, that was it. You know, I was right up on a great performance. It just, just went the other way. So I just got to move on. You know, it's, it's boxing. You know, you get things like that happen all the time in boxing. For me, it's all about moving on, keep my head up and keep, you know, let the things like that don't let me down and keep working hard the next next fight. No, I, I always say, I would love to, love to get a rematch, you know, but I think, do I think it's going to happen in the next fight? No, but I think I would love to in the future, but, you know, I don't know whether, how long is my guy going to be at that weight for, and, but I would love that down the line, definitely, you know, but would it happen in the next fight? I don't think so, though. For me, it's just all about winning and getting better and better with every fight. For me, I'm always learning this trade, you know, you, stop, you only stop learning once you retire, and uh, I'll get better every fight, and uh, I think this is just a start for me to show my skills. I think obviously when, obviously when you watch boxing, you always, all these two names always stick out to everybody, it's Tyson Muhammad Ali. But see, once you get de uh, longer into boxing, you find out boxing is more than Muhammad Ali and uh, Tyson, I'm talking about especially the lower weights, you get fires at my weight. Like, you know, I, I was a big fan of Orlando Kansi. I, he was a, I liked him as a fire. And he was, you know, he was really, really clever. I think he was a great, I think he had about 15, 16 defenses of the IBF world title. And uh, I try, try to do obviously, I try to watch much that I can of him. I think they can expect a friend friendly style, a clever style, you know, someone that takes a lot of punches and, you know, you'll see something different. That's all I can say.